In this task, we are asked to plot two of the quarterly temperature anomaly series across time. So remember we have the years in rows and then first the months, but then also the quarterly series in columns. Uh, DJF meaning December, January, February and JJA June, July, August. And we want to compare this and this column. So how do we uh, achieve this? For simplicity, what I'll do is I'll copy the following three columns. A, the year, P for DJF, and R for JJA. So I highlight Control C, and uh, let me go into a new worksheet. And here I Control V, copy the data next to each other. So we see uh, DJF quarter doesn't have an observation for 1880, so we'll uh, delete this. And in fact, I will also delete the first row that will make life just slightly easier. So what I now do is I highlight these two columns, the two series I want to plot. I go to charts and say line chart. And that is exactly what I want. The first improvement to this chart I want to make is to make it slightly bigger, to make it easier to see. Now we can see on the horizontal axis, we really want to have our years. We achieve that by right mouse clicking into the chart, go to select data, and horizontal axis labels, go to edit, and we'll just pick our year column and press OK. And now if we go to our line chart on the top, we will see the years.